magnification of thin lenses magnification of thin lenses magnification is denoted by the small letter m which is ratio of height of image by ratio by height of object height will be considered as positive if it is measured from the principal axis above and height will be considered negative if it is measured from principal axis down as per the new sign convention so for convex lens let us take for convex lens and concave lens very simple if the image formed image formed is inverted that means height of image is negative and always we consider always we consider the height of object positive because it is always kept above the principal axis the so height of object object is always considered as positive so magnification will be negative so this is always this is always positive and if it is negative then it forms a negative magnification if it is positive height of image is positive it is and this is always positive therefore it is positive and if the image form is inverted and image formed is erect that is h of image h of image is positive therefore magnification is equal to positive by positive is equal to positive very simple image formed will be the magnification will be negative if inverted image is formed and magnification will be positive if the image from this the height of the image is positive so for convex lens this is convex lens first f 2f if the object is kept beyond 2f first case if the object is kept beyond 2f then the image is formed Near to f means it is formed between f and to f, and it will be small image. Case one. In this case, this is positive height of object is positive height of image is negative. In this case, magnet magnification is equal to height of image by height of object is equal to. negative by positive is equal to negative so magnification is equal to negative if it is kept at 2f if it is kept at 2f then the magnification form the image will be formed at 2f this is second case so here also m is equal to height of image is negative and it is positive is equal to negative magnification negative so if it is kept between 2f and f the image will be formed beyond 2f and enlarge image case 3 2 so in this case magnification is equal to this is negative height of image is negative divided by height of object is positive is equal to negative and if the object is kept between f and optical center if the object is kept the image will be formed enlarge like this in front of the mirror so image will be formed this is 4 4 in this case magnification is equal to height of image is positive and height of object is also positive is equal to positive therefore magnification is equal to positive only when object is kept between f and optical center c and m is equal to negative when our object object is k 
kept between f and between in between infinity to f that is if you keep the this is infinity beyond to f and up to f are between between infinity and f that magnification will, will be negative in case of convex lens for concave lens for concave lens the object is kept anywhere in front of the the object is kept anywhere in front of the lens that is f this is 2f here also f here is 2f so wherever the object is kept if the object is kept here here small it's small but virtual image is formed e b e dash b dash so height of image is equal to positive height of object also positive so magnification is equal to height of image by height of object which is positive by positive is equal to positive so magnification will be positive in case of concave lens and the magnification will be negative for convex lens with the condition that the object object should be kept beyond infinity up to the focus and if it is kept between focus and the apex center the image formed will be virtual erect in that case the image form magnification will be positive in case of convex lens convex lens it is possible to have erect as well as inverted image so magnification is positive as well as negative for convex lens concave lens sorry convex concave lens the image form the magnification is always positive so the relation between object distance object distance from optic center image distance image distance height of object height of image image we'll find the, the relation between the magnification in terms of height of image by height of object is equal to image distance from the optic center by object distance in, with the optic center so as we know for a concave or convex lens convex lens for a convex lens when the object is kept at a finite distance beyond the focus if the object is kept at finite distance beyond the focus beyond the focus suppose say we keep it here beyond the focus the object one ray will come like this and it will go through the focus another ray will go through the optic center c and they both will intersect at a point and this distance of object is this is object distance which is negative this is image distance which is positive and this is height of object which is positive this is height of image which is negative so we know since the height is above the principal axis it is positive this is negative in this case we will write we will write a simple relation instead of going for a complicated calculations we say magnification of a concave lens here the image from this image from this real and real and inverted so we can write in terms of height of image by height of object since height of image is negative height of object is positive is equal to image distance by object distance image distance is positive object distance is negative so magnification we write it here my magnification can be written as this and this this they cancel h i by h o is equal to minus v by u this and this get and so magnification in terms of image height divided by 
object height is equal to image distance from the optic center to object distance in the optic center for convex lens. Convex lens. When the image, when the object is kept, when the object is kept at finite distance with respect to the lens. For convex lens, it is also producing. It it also produces virtual image when it is kept closer to the lens. We have seen the second case also already when it is kept closer to the kept closer to the lens. This object is kept closer to the lens. Then it one day goes and it will go through the focus another ray. From this it will go like this. So both the rays will not meet. So it means we extend it backward. Extended these two rays backward. The image is formed here. In this case, the image is virtual and virtual and erect. So it means height of object is as it is positive. Height of image is also positive. See here when there is a change in the sign of height, then the magnification form is negative. When there is a no change, if both are positive, they both are the object height and image height both are having same sign positive positive. We can write magnification is equal to height of image by height of object is equal to distance of image and distance of object. Here H i is equal to H i is also positive, H o is also positive. Image distance. This is the image distance V. And this is the object distance both are negative negative so therefore magnification is equal to height of image by height of object is equal to v by u distance of image divided by distance of objects so in this case also in this case also the magnification is equal to height of that is height of magnification height of image by height of object is equal to v by u for convex whether the image is real or real or virtual so general formula is the magnification is equal to for convex lens whether the image is formed real or virtual the magnification is equal to h a by i h i by h o is equal to v by u for convex lens let us see for concave lens let us see for concave lens this is concave lens when the object is kept anywhere in front of the lens when the object is kept anywhere in front of the lens the object is kept here the object is kept here one ray after refraction it will be diverging another ray passing through the optic center it will go like this the image when it is so when you extend it backward the image is formed here it is object A V image A dash V dash. Here, wherever the object is kept in front of the lens, the virtual and erect image will be formed. So H I and H O will have same sign positive. So magnification is given by H I by h o is equal to v by u with the sign convention here also there also for convex lens also we put with the sign convention here also we have to put sign convention h i and h both are positive this is also positive u this is this is v and this distance is u so both are negative because it is coming against the ray direction we are measuring from the optic center against the ray direction therefore h of i by h of o is equal to v by u to see whether it is convex or concave lens 
whether the image is produced real or virtual, the magnification is given by with sign, with sign convention, height of image by height of object is equal to distance of image with respect to the optic lens, optical center and this object, distance of object with respect to optical center. So this is the magnetic formula for magnification for all convex or concave lens irrespective of the image is formed. Therefore, we can write for, for lens magnification is equal to height of image by height of object by V by U. So first case we can see magnification if magnitude of magnification we can write magnification the height of image is equal to magnification into height of object if we can take the modulus value because the minus sign comes only for whether the height is erect or if minus mean height is inverted if h is positive then height is erect so modulus of m is equal to modulus of m is greater than 1 it means h i by h o is greater than 1 that is h i is greater than h of o it means if magnification is greater than 1 the height of image will be greater than height of object second if magnification is less than 1 in that case height of image by height of object is less than 1 that is height of image is less than height of object. <coughs> the second case in if third case if magnitude of magnification is equal to 1 it means height height of image by height of object is equal to 1 that case height of image is equal to height of object and magnitude will be negative magnitude will be negative if h i and h o having having opposite sign opposite sign if m is equal to positive if h i and h o have same sign in this case h i opposite sign means this is positive this is negative same sign means they both are positive this is in case of concave lens and convex lens when the image is kept very close to the lens. Then we can write magnitude in terms of in terms of V by U. For V by U divide this equation. When we divide this equation we know the lens maker formula. What is mirror formula? Mirror formula 1 by V plus 1 by U is equal to 1 by F. Same why I am writing V in the first because this is for mirror for lens for lens we write 1 by v by 1 by u is equal to 1 by f instead of plus you put minus this is the equation for mirror equation for lens and mirror for mirror positive will come for lens negative will come so we take this equation 1 by v minus 1 by u is equal to 1 by f that is lens for blur divide this equation divide this equation by u then multiply this equation by u multiply this equation by u so u by v is minus u by u is equal to u by f and u by v u by v is equal to u by f this is one and where it is going it will become plus one so u by v is equal to f plus u by f and we know v by f is equal to v by magnification is equal to v by u which is equal to v by u reverse it it become f divided by f plus u f divided by f plus u this is the equation for magnification in terms of in terms of in terms of u and v this is the equation for for in terms of f and u so f and u same equation multiplied by v 
So the, when you multiply by V, this will become 1 minus V by U is equal to V by F. V by F or we take this other side. So V by U is equal to 1 minus V by F. 1 minus V by F can be written as F minus V, F minus V by F. So V by U is nothing but magnification. Magnification is equal to F minus V by F. This is magnification in terms of focal length and image distance. This is the equation for magnification equation. So this is the equation for magnification in terms of focal length and object distance.